The enemy has already entered the nuclear launch code. Secure the president before they can confirm and finalize the code input. The president is on the first floor of Shell 2's core. This is the way to Shell 2's core section, where the president is. First, cross the connecting bridge between the two shells. You'll arrive. Raiden, be careful. Colonel, the radar's not working. With Shell 2 in this shape, I wouldn't count on the radar coming back online for a while. It'll be all right. Hang in there, Jack. With the radar offline, you'll have to rely on first-person view to check for enemy presence. Proceed with extreme caution. Right. Answer me. Right. This is not a pretty sight. Hurry up and check the situation. Encounter the enemy requesting the Right, what's going on? Right! Right! Encounter. 
to the end of your request. <laughs> My father had some unfinished business with him. Olga, calm yourself. What? 
for this day for two years, and I will send him to the bottom of the ocean, right next to my old man. The launch comes first. Damn it. Where is Ocelot? Not here. I don't him. Don't talk that way about one of your own. He's not one of my own. He left my father to die, remember? Olga, we'll talk later. We need to get started on the final checks for the unit. All right. I'm headed back there. The upper connecting bridge to Shell 1 is down. What about the chopper? The cam off is out of action. Take the oil fence from Strut Elm. I'll tell my men to start pulling out. Not yet. Their retrieval comes last. The intruder's still at large. Snake. What about the other man? got luck on his side, certainly. He survived that explosion. Listen, Olga, the code confirmation is in one hour. Keep the President alive until then. I know. No one gets in here. Turn the currents on. Of course. High voltage currents on. The door stays shut unless the president manages to take out that circuit panel from inside the room. And it's no job for bare hands. All right. Come back immediately. One more thing. What? We leave for Russia when this business is done. I want half the money for that. Of course. That was part of the agreement. We start living for ourselves after this. If there's anyone who wants to stay here, I want you to take good care of them. Gladly. Gerlukovich soldiers are the cream of the crop. It's time they went free. What happened to rebuilding Mother Russia? The old man is there. The world is a different place now. It's your life. Just as a reminder, I'm going to say this again one last time. Don't try anything on us. The fear I'm in front of the room where they're keeping the president. Everything all right? No sign of flooding, but I can't get close to the door. The floor is electrified. Don't test it. You'll be bacon. Any suggestions? Remember the Shadow Moses VR training. Take out the circuit panel? Right. But there's no way into the room. Try ventilation ducts. Yeah, I think I see one. Look for a remote control missile launcher. You can guide it through the duct, into the room. Then target the circuit panel. Got it. Right, but make sure you don't hit the President. The President is wired with nanomachines. If we know the frequency, I can raise him. We've tried that repeatedly, but there's no response. It looks like the walls have a built-in radio shield. So that's why Ames lost contact with him. If you need to confirm his position, you can log into the node. Understood. Locate a remote control missile launcher first.
Snake, do you know where I can find some remote-controlled missiles? Remote-controlled missiles? I saw something on B1 in the core of Shell 2. But be careful. Contaminated seawater's broken out of the tanks thanks to that explosion. Most of B1 is probably flooded by now. Colonel, B-1 is completely flooded from what I can see. You'll have to swim through. I'm fine with swimming. Stroke the water and move forward by pushing the punch button. Push it in rapid succession to swim faster. Change your heading with the left stick. Up will take you up, down takes you lower. Left and right to face those directions. The O2 gauge will appear under your life gauge while you're underwater. The gauge corresponds to the amount of air you can hold from a single deep breath. Once the O2 gauge falls to zero, the life gauge will start to drop. You need to be aware of that. You have the remote-controlled missile. Good job. Now head for the first floor of the Shell 2 core. Take out the power source and make contact with the President before the launch code can be reconfirmed. Hurry! Thank <laughs> you. 
What's up, Jack? Jack, tell me, am I really helping you out? Yeah, you're a huge help. I'm lucky to have you as an analyst. But didn't you tell me just a little while ago that I should change my job or quit or something? Yeah, you were pretty pissed off. Why did you say those things? Well, you have to work overtime and stuff. It sounded pretty tough. But you didn't mean it, did you? I was wrong about a lot of things then. I just thought that if we had more time to spend together that... You were thinking of your own danger. Ah, uh, well... Don't you think it's selfish to expect everyone to be at your beck and call? I'm not your personal possession, you know. That's not how I think of you. Is that so? Yeah. Listen, I like you, and I like the me that likes you. But I do not like being summed up as Jack's girlfriend. The very thought of it makes me shiver. There's a lot more to me than just being your girlfriend. The fact that I'm doing the job I want to do is part of that, understand? Yeah, of course, I... I want to be recognized, first of all, for who I really am, especially by you. I don't want you, of all people, thinking that I'm just your girlfriend. Th that's not what I think at all. Can you really say that? Absolutely. Really? I'm glad.